Hi, welcome back to day seven of our scarf tying series. You've been with us now a full week, and I really have to thank you for coming back and sharing and liking our videos. We really appreciate it. If you would have told me a few months ago that I would even be doing this, I would have thought you were absolutely crazy because for those of you who know me really well, number one, I don't like getting my picture taken, and number two, I really, really dislike being on camera and videos, and now that I look back on it, even when my kids were younger, my number one regret is that I wish I would have been in more of those videos, and so I've really stepped outside of my comfort zone to do this, and one of the things about our store is all about inspiration and I really want to inspire women to do more and be more and that's a lot of what this our Facebook page is about. You'll notice that we do share product but we do share more of inspiration and so I'm hoping that by me stepping out and doing things that make me uncomfortable that I might inspire some of you to do the same. So today I want to talk a little bit about the jewelry I'm wearing and also I want to talk about uh, this pashmina that I have here and how you can tie it. I want to show you this piece of jewelry because I really love this. This is something new that we got in last fall and they sold out immediately and we were not even able to get them back in until this spring and actually it looks like a locket but really what it is is it's it's a watch and so anyway you open it up and there's a little watch inside so it's a really like a novelty gift it makes a great gift um, something for yourself and with with all the graduations and proms coming up it makes a really nice gift as well so just wanted to share that with you and also want to talk about another way to tie a scarf and recently when I was on one of my buying trips I uh, was talking to one of my suppliers and he had, he had shared this way of how to tie a scarf and he said he actually was the one that came up with it. Now I don't know if that's true or not but anyway I want to share it with you today. He called it the pretzel. So anyway you just take it, divide your scarf in half, you take it around and you have this loop. What you do is you just take one piece and put it in through the loop as you can see now you're left with another piece, but what you do with this piece is that you take it and go over the top and you just pull it down through. And actually it does look like a little bit like a pretzel. So that's our tip for the day on how to tie a scarf. Thank you for being with us again today. We really appreciate it and we look forward to seeing you again tomorrow.